Hello everybody, this is Kyoshi here and welcome back to another video. In this video, I'll be reviewing Wendy's Kids Meal Toys 2023, the Square View Heroes Toys. So without further ado, let's get started. Let's take a look at the uh, Kids Meal bag first. Here we have the bag packaging. Very nice, it's like a real map of a town. This re really remind me of Lego and also Minecraft. Um, I feel like they have, they've done this in the past, so it's not like a complete stranger to me and then on the side it shows all these different figures you can collect or these different sets you can get from this particular set there's six in total and over this side it's just some um mix and match games you can mix and match the characters with the items they use the back is just that kids meal all right and now let's let's just keep the packaging right here it looked pretty decent. And here we have, I have two um, bags to review. One is a home and school. The other one is the grocery and police station. Once again, these really reminded me of Lego um, and Minecraft. <laughs> Anyways, uh, let's start with home and school. Let's take a look. Um, here's the packaging, by the way. I really like it. Uh, that's what it looks like. It's a mixture of plastic and paper goods. Uh, basically, it's like a Lego. I don't know what else to say. But, um, cool. Let's rip this off. Get these out. Okay. It's emptied out. All right. Home and school. Okay. We got this thingy. I believe it's the base. Here we have this thingy. I believe it's the other base. Um, we have two... Uh, cab looking thingy. This will be the uh, human figures or the figures, the characters. Um, just need stickers. And here we have the school cardboard. Oh, and here we have uh, maybe home cardboard. All right. And here we have the stickers. Okay. Um, there is no instructions. However, um, I think you can just base on this thingy from the back to do your magic and also with your own creation you know it's mix and match let's build something together i hope i have everything it feels like i'm missing something mm. yeah i feel like I'm missing something here it seems like there's supposed to be these little signs right here but um definitely the bag is emptied but um, it's all right. Let's I'll just leave it here, and then let's just go by there. First, we have the school. Okay, and then this is the door. Um, I don't know. Oh, this is the top. This is this part is removable, and here we have the school. And then one of the base gather one of the base, and just snap this thing in there. Pretty straightforward. All right, here we have the school build right here. I'm gonna make it nicer afterwards, but now let's just try to build it first. And then this piece we just ripped off from the door. Um, take this piece out. Okay, square view, school. And then we're supposed to attach to this little part right there. I believe this you're supposed to rip a little bit. So they can connect it like so. So there we have the school sign. All right. Huh, there's a five right here. I wonder what that means. Does it say anything? Now it just tells you how to put it on. All right. Here we have the school. Pretty easy forward. And then here's the back, it's interior. Um, oh yeah, classroom number five. Now I get it what that means. This is classroom number five. So you can either display it this way or you can display it this way. And now let's build the character. Drift this thingy. Let's see what character can we build here. Um, it seems like a female teacher from classroom five. That's interesting. Okay, is there a particular uh front and back thingy let's take a look okay this should be in the center somewhere okay i'm gonna use this as the front um okay let's just apply the stickers 
I hope I don't mess this. Applying stickers are both fun and annoying because um, it's really hard to make it perfect, you know, if you have OCD. This is going to kill you. Um, but um, luckily, I don't. <laughs> but I'll still try my best because you do want to, you know, make it pretty. Um, so when you look at it, it's not horrible. Okay, I don't think I'm doing a good job here, but um, being, you know, filmed live on camera... I feel like I tried my best. This thing's a little off already, as you can see. Um, if I can rip it off and redo it, I would redo it. All right, I have another chance to make it right this time. Um, okay, not the best still, but um, okay. And last, we have this thingy. All right, here we have the teacher with the school right here. All right, and we have another one to build. Here we have, same thing, remove the door. Here we have, um, I think it's called a school and home. This is a home. Same thing, attach this to this. Just slide it in to this already pre-cut. Okay, and then the door get it off we see this little part right here um i think you're supposed to do it this way yeah my bad okay here we have the basketball um court right there and then here we have the pink house all right and then you flip to the other side here we have the interior of the home okay they also have a little home fish tank, fish bowl right there. Okay, here we have, and also they, they can connect together by doing so, like a puzzle. So we're gonna put them together. All to right, let's remove this. I think it will be more even and nicer. Okay, here we have the school and here we have the home and here we have teacher at the school. And now we have another one to build. Um, the little boy okay wish me luck here um i'm building the boy okay here we have the boy let's build this okay the boy is also holding a basketball that's nice Ooh. It's hard, it's hard, but uh, yeah, I mean, this can build your patience, actually. I do have patience, but it just, it's hard to do it, uh, you know, there's a camera in between my real eyes and this thingy, so. <laughs> okay, here we have the little boy holding a basketball. All right, in front of his home. We, has, we also have a bunch of uh, additional stickers included. I think you can use these stickers to decorate the house, you know. Um, yeah, I feel like these, you can use it to decorate it. Um, like the front or the back. You know, the interior. But um, of course, the instruction didn't say what you, what you can do with it. I just said, be creative and then build something on your own. Here we have the school with the teacher and the home with the little boy right there. All right, now let's move forward to the next one, which is grocery and police station. With the experience from the other one, I think this time we're gonna make it real quick here. Here's the bag, by the way. Once again, looking absolutely amazing. Here is the little thingy we're gonna use to build our thingy. Okay, same thing here. Uh, pretty straightforward. I'm just gonna lock it right there this time. And then let's do the uh, Monster Mart. What a nice name. I like this name. Here's interior. Oh, okay. I'm just going to slide this in. Okay. See with the experience that we had earlier, it's a lot easier this time. And slide this inward. 
All right, here we have the grocery, the Monster Mart, and then here's the back. Okay, now let's build the other one first this time, the police station. Okay, here we have the front of the police station, and here we have the back. I actually do like the police station more. It's looking really, really cool. All right, now we can take a look. This is how the neighborhood looked like from the front. This is how the neighborhood looked like from the back. Look at the surveillance cameras, it looks so real. All right, now, oh yeah, sorry, I forgot the tag right here. Okay, here we have the little cut right there. This time it's supposed to be somewhere here. Um, all right, the police sign. Here we have this, looking absolutely amazing. Now we have the two characters. This is for the um, supermarket and this is for the police. Okay, here we have all these amazing stickers. These are for your own imaginations. Whatever you want to display it, you know, how you want to sticker it, it's on your own. And here we have, oh, here we have the cashier or the worker working at, <laughs> at a grocery and here we have the police. Let's do the police. Okay, I really like the police um, theme, so I hope I'm doing it um, nicely. Because I really like this one um, for some reason. We, it's hard. It's hard. It's still tilted. It's not like straight, straight, but all right, I tried. Okay. Sometimes you just have to accept the fact nothing is perfect. As long as you try your best, making it as perfect as possible within your ability, that is a passing grade, you know? Okay, one more. And also sometimes you have to realize imperfection, it's also a kind of perfection. <laughs> Here we have the uh, little policeman right there, or policeman. Um, since I see the earrings, maybe it's a female, but you know, males can have earrings too. We'll just call whatever. Okay, now let's do the little store, uh, a store employee, I guess. Her uniform, his uniform reminded me of like 7-Eleven, like those people. The people who work at 7-Eleven, the uniform they wear. I go to 7-Eleven a lot, almost every other night. <laughs> Uh, I mean, they open 24 hours and sometime when you get when you're just really hungry or really uh, thirsty want something to drink I always go by there Because you know, that's somewhere you can always get food or drinks Okay Last one I feel like I nailed this one. This one's looking absolutely amazing the way I did it Okay, here we have the little employee right there. Very cute. <laughs> Even the monster logos are on his shirt. Here we have it. Um, okay, now let's see if we, if we can put everything together. Probably not, because my camera is, you know, not this wide, but I will try. Um, you can put all four together, make it a scenery. Oh yeah, look, looks beautiful. I mean, I just have to extend it a little. You guys can see this whole, um, okay, this is not, okay, now it's all stick together. Here we have the entire amazing, here we have the school, the house, uh, the supermarket and the police station, uh, part of the Square View um, neighborhood. Looking absolutely amazing. Just imagine you have all collected all of these and built them together. How amazing it will look. And you have a lot of characters as well. This is a great set. I actually do really, really like it. It really reminds me of Lego and Minecraft. Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. And I'll talk to you guys in the next video. Bye-bye.